A question of character. Heihachi is the ultimate daddy. Heihachi is heir to the Mashima clan and heir to the hair. Heihachi's mustache is spiked. Heihachi's eyebrows are spiked. But this is youthful Heihachi. Heihachi is now old, but still daddy. Daddy has a company to reclaim. Mishima Zaibatsu, although current leader and grandson Jean is missing. Finding Jean is not his top priority. Instead, Heihachi decides, I'll just take over the company myself. Knock, knock. Heihachi continues the Mishima family tradition of betrayal. Mishima are taught this at a very young age. For instance, Heihachi spent quality time with his son Keizuya, sending him on a field trip right off of a cliff. Betrayal. Heihachi fears nothing. People, bullets, missiles, kick. Most people avoid lava. Heihachi fights within it. Most people shave it off at a point. Heihachi grabs the hair gel and spikes what's left. Barely anything. Nina is Heihachi's trusty sidekick after he beats her into being his trusty sidekick. Heihachi prefers to settle debates with his feet, foregoing diplomacy. He beats you, you work for him. It's the Mashima way. Heihachi dresses of a king, a devil king, flashy, devilly hair. It is the true outfit of intimidation. His gi sports the face of a tiger. Heihachi also has a suit, a big suit. It is the true tailored outfit of intimidation. Heihachi owns the airwaves. Heihachi has a talented family lineage of betrayers. Son Keizuya, main betrayer, head of G Corporation, and a laser demon. Grandson Jean, secondary betrayer that does not betray much in the this instance, but his grandmother. Whoa, but she is a betrayer. Hey, Hachi. Kills or she's dead. Kasumi performed the ultimate betrayal. Attempted mariticide. Therefore, Heihachi commits uxoricide. Heihachi adores inappropriate laughter. When his future co-workers attempt to kill him. When melting buildings with a satellite laser. Keizuya's demonic form may lead one to believe that Heihachi has demonic sperm. Fallacious assumption. Mommy is the devil. Heihachi's semen is of the Lord. In fact, in fact, Heihachi fathered an illegitimate hero named Lars just to prove his point. Look what I made from sex. Completely demonless. Heihachi practices Mishima Ru Karate, enhanced with the power of electricity. Lightning bolt punch. Lightning hammer. Heihachi performs the guillotine chop, bending you over his knee as punishment, becoming the ultimate daddy. But instead of spanking, he chops your neck. Heihachi laughs during the shadow step. Evasion is hilarious. Heihachi is surprisingly agile for a man of his wrinkles. You wouldn't believe that he is a day over 78. Heihachi seeks to completely betray his son. Tossing him off a cliff was just not enough. Heihachi must prove that Keizuya is a demon and that he is the bearer of truth. Nothing will stop Heihachi. Not an army. His own army. Not Keizuya of the past, or his snarky letters. Not this reporter. And not Lava. Well, maybe Lava. Next episode. Oh my god, it's Kirby. Were their last words. Quest with me. Learn with us. Enrich your mind. Empower your anchor like our material. Subscribe to our page. Put character into question. Return every Monday for more. A question of character. character. It's so hard to say goodbye. Jay.